YouTube, welcome to the Fashionista Professor channel. And so today I am showcasing my Halloween look and I am channeling an Egyptian queen. You all know I'm from West Africa, so I'll take artistic liberty and be channeling the Egyptian queen. So this is what I was gonna wear, one of the outfits I was gonna wear to host a Halloween party at my house this year, but because of the outbreak, the party is canceled and I'm not gonna be having any more Halloween party. So I decided to vlog the look for you guys. So this is crystal bikini set. And you guys remember I said, you know, with regards to the evolving trends in fashion, there is no dichotomy anymore between the outfits. So you can wear it as a bikini, you can wear it as lingerie. And I've actually worn the top with a skirt and boots um, for dinner. Okay, and so you guys remember this headpiece. I modeled one like that uh, from Area for my crystal gown. And so this is a crystal headpiece, which is very rem reminiscent of African in the past. I remember when I used to go, <laughs> my mom used to go to dinner parties, she used to have this headband that looked like a tiara. So what do you all think of this look? Is it fabulous for Halloween or what? So let's talk about the outfit. So you have this crystal tongue that I, um, you know, for modesty, I went ahead and put a black tongue underneath it. And at the back is just a metal, you know, the, of the crystal tongue is just metal. So I'm not sure that I'm gonna show the back of this tongue here, but I will be showing the unedited version on my Patreon at uh, Fashionista Professor. And I'll post a few pictures on Instagram at fashionista.professor. And then of course you guys can watch the vlog here on YouTube at Fashionista Professor. So this is my um, Halloween look. I was actually thinking about doing about a really nice, but I decided to go as an African princess in crystal, all blinged out. So comment down below and let me know what you think of the look. Is it a go or not? <laughs> And so let's talk about how I am styling it. So I am styling it with this bling, bling, blinged out uh, sunglasses. Let's take a closer look at the sunglasses. Can you all see the sunglasses and the crystals? I hope you guys can see the close up of the crystals. Um, you know, um, hopefully the camera is getting it. And then, of course, I have these hand pieces that are kind of large. I could make them tighter, but I'm afraid I will break them. Do you see how they glisten in the light? And then, of course, my crystal sunglasses and the crystal headpiece and the, the Fashion Nova boots, crystal rhinestone boots. I was going to wear it with black shoes, heels, I decided that the rhinestones would be better. So, you know, to go with the sparkle sparkle, shine shine. So, <laughs> this is the look, 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 look. It kind of reminds me of what um, 
uh, one of the crystal outfits that Sati has. But anyway, this is my look for Halloween. So comment down below and let me know what you think of it. I actually have this in different iterations of crystal. Um, I'm gonna be vlogging them down the line. And then I also have it in gold crystal, which I'll be vlogging down the line. So comment down below and let me know what you think. Is this a yes or a no? <laughs> so talking about the outfit, the outfit has um, chains. Uh, the, panty, the panty tongue has um, the metal uh, ties that you can hook up. And so it's hooked up at the back. I'll show you a little bit here. And then of course the top, you hook it up. And you guys have seen me wearing something similar to this with my skirt, you know, which I wear for dinner. And I totally love this. And then the sunglasses. So let me go ahead and do the Fashionista Professor showcasing of this outfit, okay? You know, which involves dancing. Maybe I should do the belly dance, okay? Because this reminds me of belly dance outfits that I see when I go to the Middle East or to parts of Africa, you know, so like in Egypt and stuff like that. But, you know, I don't want to do my sensual belly dancing. So let me just go ahead and do a combination of my regular dance and gymnastics in showcasing this outfit for you all. So I appreciate your comments. I look forward to your comments. Comment down below and let me know if this is a fabulous ooh la la, ooh la la Halloween outfit. So let's go ahead and do the Fashionista Professor runway showcasing of this outfit. So music, hit it.
So that's it for the fashionista professor showcasing of this outfit. I hope you guys enjoy the vlog as much as I enjoy making it for you guys. So I try to use the hand movements, the dancing hand movements instead of using my, instead of doing the belly dance, you know, to keep it PG-13. And, um, you know, it was a lot of fun. Um, it's a pity I cannot wear it for Halloween, but it's better to continue to social distance and stuff like that. Um, you know, comment down below and let me know what you think about it. I'll have more pictures and extended edition on my Patreon at Fashionista Professor and on Instagram. I'll have pictures of the outfit at Fashionista uh, Professor, and of course. You guys are gonna see um, this vlog on my YouTube channel, a fashionista professor. And do check out my other vlogs on YouTube as well and let me know what you think of them. So this is it for the review of this crystal outfit, Halloween outfit that sort of reminds me of back home in Africa. You all know like how when you are having your traditional marriage and you have the crystals and the headpieces. Can you see how this headpiece is? I'm sure, well, I need to attach pictures of how it is when you're having your traditional marriage and you have this crystal headpiece and the head, the uh, crystal or gold pieces here. And, um, you know, you don't necessarily have this one, but you can have beads around the waist, okay? And I love the rhinestone shoes. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being with us. And if you have not yet subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button here or here, depending on where it may be on your screen. And please do turn on the notification such that you'll be notified when next I upload a vlog. So till next time, I upload another Ulala fabulous vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for your kind comments. Kisses. Kisses from far away. Kisses from far away. Kisses from far away. Kisses. Yeah.